right here is where the YouTube video will start. Hello, welcome back. We've set up menus and stuff for the last 12 minutes. It's been very boring. I set up cooking menus and we went through all the characters, skills and stuff, and changed some stuff around. It was, uh... It was fun. Let's actually begin. Oh yeah, I need to figure out how to get back to this version of the guide in the future. Like the HTML version. Special version. Alright. This is where you can register participant call and see him tournaments. We hold night the best as well. Okay. Think you can register in the middle of the night? Guess you found me. You're pretty good. I'll teach you to cook as a reward. Bob sandwich. This you can practice. Thank you. And there it goes. Do I need to have anyone cook that? Nope, not really. Lord Bellius's private room is ahead. I cannot allow you to go any further. But we've come to see Bellius. What? Who are you? We're a guild! Brave Vesperia! I haven't heard of you. Do you have an appointment with the Duce? Huh? An appointment? Unfortunately, my lord only meets with individuals who have appointments. How about a messenger from Don Whitehorse? The Don? Oh, my apologies. My name is Nats. I'm the acting representative for the Duce. I will gladly deliver any message you have for the Duce. Sorry, but the Don's orders were to give this letter directly to Bellius. Is that so? Unfortunately, Bellius only receives guests on the night of a new moon. If you could perhaps come on the next new moon. The next new moon? Why only on the night of a new moon? I guess that's just how she does things. People can be weird sometimes. The moon just turned full, so the new moon is still a while away. So should we come back? We don't really have a choice if she's not here. Sorry for the trouble. I'll let her know that a messenger from the Dawn stopped by. Great, thanks. So why don't we see what we can find out about the desert? And about Pharaoh, too. I'd like to get some information about the air crene myself. We shouldn't have trouble getting information about all of that in a city this big. You mind if old Raven goes ahead to the inn? I should send off a progress report to the Don. Sure. All right, let's get going, too. Raven left. Aw. Guess we're going to the inn. Yeah. Yeah. Du, 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 du. Du, 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 na, na, na. Just making sure, because there's a side quest I missed here once, and it was because I fucked around too much. Welcome. Staying the night? I think a companion of ours should have already arrived. A friend of yours? No. I'm afraid no one else has arrived today. <sighs> that hopeless old man must still be wandering around. Then why don't we go talk to some more people ourselves? All right. All right, let's go around. Duh, 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 duh. Anyone's oh well I'm guessing it's a you. Hey, isn't that Patty? What's she doing? It looks like she's shopping. Give me one of these and one of these. E yes, ma'am. Wait a second, dear. Um those clothes are uh, I'm sorry, but are you Eifried's granddaughter? 
It's just that there's been a rumor going around. People say there's a girl dressed like Eifried who claims to be his granddaughter. <sighs> huh? Granddaughter? That means... I knew it. Your total comes to 450 gold. Um, could I ask you to stop coming here? Is that because I'm Eifried's granddaughter? Uh, well, you see, I don't really mind myself, but our customers, you see. Huh? What? Wait just a second. I didn't say anything like that. Darling, you just said it hurt our reputation if the granddaughter of an outlaw shopped here. Well, yeah, she's the granddaughter of a guy who violated the guild's morals and slaughtered tons of people. Well, that's... Cut the crap. What? Do you honestly think a child is responsible for that? What exactly did she do that was wrong? It's okay, Yuri. No need to get angry. This kind of stuff happens all the time. What is up with you? He was saying all of that for your sake. You don't have to worry about me. I'm leaving town soon enough anyway. Farewell. Uh, hey, wait up! <sighs> uh, I swear. Patty is Eifried's granddaughter? I wonder what that's all about. She never mentioned that before. I wonder if it's true. I don't know. Who knows? But even so, is Eifried's reputation really that bad? After the Black Hope Massacre, he lost the trust of every guild. And now most guild members utterly despise him. Ah, okay. Uh, Yuri, are you sure it's okay to let her go? This is Patty we're talking about. She's a strong girl. I'm sure she'll be fine. Right. Anyway, if we don't get back soon, the old man might get sick of waiting and start some mischief again. That's true. Great, let's go back. Is Patty alright? She's tough. She'll pop back up soon enough. Do you think Patty's really Eifried's granddaughter? Even if she is, that treatment is inexcusable. Patty has done nothing wrong. Regardless of the guild's trust, it's not unusual that Patty would bear the brunt of the anger. Eifried isn't around to take it, after all. But that's still no excuse to blame Patty. True. Patty, you mustn't get used to all of this. I wonder if they'll ever figure out the weird quality on the new voice lines in the skits. This is really weird. They're just really low quality. And for some reason, they're always much quieter than the, all the old skits. Much quieter. Anyways. Oh, you're the customers from before. Wait a second. You wouldn't happen to have a companion who's a flashy dresser. Well, Flashy's one way to describe him. I see. Your rooms have already been paid for, so please, make yourselves at home. Yeah. Shall we call it a day? Good idea. We've earned a good night's sleep. Hey, Raven's back. Are you missing the castle? No, I just... I thought I'd come out for some fresh air. I just can't shake those words Pharaoh said to me. Oh yeah. What was it again? The insipid poison of this world must be purged. The world's poison? Hmm. Yeah, well, the world is full of pessimists, that's for sure. For what it's worth, you don't look like poison to me. Was that your attempt to cheer me up? Hey, I'm just trying to be straight with you. <laughs> I guess I do feel a little better. Hey! Yuri, look at that! Hmm? 
That's brave Vesperia. The brightest star in the night sky. There's an old story about that star. In the days of old, a great cataclysm occurred that plunged the world into ruin. Countless lives were lost as the people struggled to stand against the oncoming disaster. Its energies all but spent, humanity's hope seemed lost when a pair of siblings appeared. This brother and sister together fought the calamity and saved the world from annihilation. The sister they called Child of the Full Moon. After the struggle, she remained with the Earth. Her brother they called Brave Vesperia, and he ascended to the skies to watch over the world. The end. Wow, so you went and gave our guild a name with a lot of baggage. Now that you know the story, you should strive to make your guild shine as bright as the star. Yeah, we'll have to tell Carol about this. We'll definitely have to live up to the name. I'm gonna head back. You should too, or Rita's gonna start worrying about you. Okay. There we go. All right, now that was... All right, we spoke to Patty, we stayed at the inn. All right. Let's head south. That man is just swinging at nothing. Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. You started all of this, huh? What are you talking about? B -b -b Both of you, st st stop this nonsense. M -m making a scene like this out in front of everyone. Mind your own business! You'd better put that away before you hurt yourself. Who the hell are you? Hey! If I'm wrong for doing this, you'll have my apology later. But I think it's you two who are in the wrong here. Damn it! Are you okay? Oh, thank you so m much. You were wi with m m Madam President C Kaufman. We're the Guild Brave Vesperia. Come on, you're like a walking billboard. <laughs> Let him have his fun. You're a gay of Ruins Gate, right? You might want to work out a little before you go trying to stop any more fights. Oh, yes. I'm sorry. Thanks. Oh, uh, there's a f favor I wanted to ask of you. Far be it from us to ignore a request from Ruinsgate. Well, it depends on what it is. What did you want to ask us? P -p Perhaps we could discuss this somewhere else. Could you come to the Coliseum? We could talk about it. Useless. Oh, you just wait. Whatever he has to say, he doesn't want anyone else to overhear. Sounds pretty suspicious to me. If Ruinsgate recognizes us, it'll help improve our reputation as a guild. Get too greedy with jobs and you'll end up neglecting all of them. Our job for the moment. Well, I don't want to spoil too much, but... Uh... Yeah. Is to look for Pharaoh and to escort Estelle. Yeah. You're right. I'll try to be more careful. But couldn't we at least hear what he has to say first, and then decide whether or not to accept? Yeah, maybe you're right. If he asks too much, we'll just say no. We don't have the time to be getting wrapped up in more craziness. Let's go and stop by the Coliseum then. We can at least hear him out. All right. Before we do all that, I need to make sure, because there is a side quest that's stupidly fucking missable. Okay, I gotta speak to a couple and stay at the inn. Do you? No. Oh, it's you. They say two more people went missing last night. You think people would know better with that guild's reputation for loan sharking, but I guess tourists don't have any idea what they're getting into. Isn't the guild in cahoots with the tipsters? Lord Pollock's regulars wouldn't fall for a scam like that. Where do they take the people who go missing? 
Who can say, but no one ever comes back, that's for sure. I hope no one disappears tonight. Oh, I hope no one disappears tonight. Let's go sleep. A town with a coliseum sure attracts a lot of different kinds of people, doesn't it? Yes, people are here for all sorts of reasons. Some come to fight, some come to watch. And then there's people like us, too. I wonder what other people think when they see us on the streets. Well, I'd say they think we're here for the fights. Maybe for you and Yuri, but I couldn't imagine Estelle as a gladiator if my life depended on it. What about me? Hmm, a lost child? Hey! Well then, what about all... Never mind. I know where this is going. Or if you miss one line of dialogue, you're fucked in the side quest? Uh, pretty much for some of them. Especially the one we're doing right now. The one we're doing right now gives you one of the best outfits in the game and two really fucking good abilities. And if you miss a single part of it, you can't finish it. Dude, Raven's the fucking best. He has some weird outfits, though. I got all of his DLC outfits. Got a fucking teacher outfit. He's got character from Tales of the Abyss. He's got that. Has that. He's great. Love Raven. We gotta sleep at the end. I'm gonna get a really good ability. Don't worry, I'm just gonna check out that rumor I heard today about people in town disappearing. Help someone, please help. Not only do you team up with tipsters to rip off innocent customers, but then you kidnap people who couldn't pay their debts and do away with them, you dirty piece of slime. This is what you deserve. Ah! He's dead. Rip. Whoa. Yep, there he goes. Who's that guy? What was that? Hey, shiny eagle. There's a couple of reference ones in there. In fact, which character do you think got the JoJo outfit? Out of my entire party, who do you think got the JoJo outfit? The answer is the dog. <laughs> there you go. He's, he is not Jodro. <laughs> because why not? Why not? Why the fuck not? I made a second save just in case. <laughs> Let's see, there's one more side quest here. And then we can actually keep on going. Uh, oh, he's fucking unmissable. I was, I was like, ah, oh, I gotta make sure I don't miss him. You can't fucking miss him. He stands like a sore fucking thumb. I wonder where the side quest is. Could it be anywhere in here? Could it be any one of these? Oh. I'm sorry, but the Duce is not currently receiving visitors. Please come back later. Hey, we keep bumping into each other. Must be fate. There is no such thing. Maybe not. What brings you to a place like this? I have come with tidings for the age-old master of this city. Thelius? Are you here on business with a guild or something? Probably not, right? It is nothing so vulgar as that. Vulgar? All right, so what kind of noble errand are you on? I need not answer that. All right, bye. Don't tell me you're out to save the world or something. <sighs> He's out to save yeah, the world or something. That guy. Great! I believe that's all the side quests for now. Oh yeah, I remember this. Alright, uh... Do I, have my, do I have my best gear equipped? I think I do. Okay, uh, we gotta find where Regay went. There he is. I need to save before I do this. Because we're about to be locked into a very long sequence, and if we fail it, it we're going to have to redo all of it, and the first couple fights are really easy, and then the last one's tough. Just save now. Uh, is that a party I would want once shit goes bad? I want Raven. 
I want Raven with me. Get Raven in the party. Uh, still be Raven. Yeah, that works. That works fine for me. With that reference, a lot of them are either uh, characters from old Tales games like this. That's uh, that's Ash from Tales of the Abyss. And there's some other ones, like there's a night outfit from the Tales of Asperia anime movie, and there's high school uniforms, there's whatever the fuck that is. There's some samurai outfits and stuff, there's that. A lot of them have all sorts of things, another Tales character, more high school stuff, that. The Viking outfit? I don't know. There's a whole bunch more we'll unlock eventually. And I'm also missing a character. Actually, no, we've... Did I just... I have these. I did. I haven't unlocked these customization packs because you can unlock these in-game and I'm gonna do them later. Alright, I'm ready. Let's fucking talk to him. Relax. Nobody said we've decided to take the job yet. That can wait till you tell us what this is all about. All right. I would like you to stop the man who is trying to t take over Palastrale. Take over? This city? Hmm. The plot thickens. Why are you so interested in stopping them, though? It's not your guild, so why not just let it be? You see, we have been commissioned by Palastrale to investigate the r ruins at the Colosseum. Huh. Yeah, come to think of it, this city's supposed to be super old. If s someone else took c control, it would be discourteous to the Entelechea. Entele... what? Ah, oh, oh yes, M -m my apologies. D do you not know of them? I have heard that th they are the ancient race who built this town and allow the guilds to be here. An ancient race, huh? Like the Critia? Okay, so then who's this guy who's trying to rock the boat here? He He's the champion of the C Colosseum. Huh? What are you talking about? He is a man who has entered the tournaments to, to, to take on Palastrale directly. His c consecutive victories have brought him closer to B Bellius. This m man is terribly dangerous. If he is not s soon eliminated, I fear that B Bellius may be... So as long as he's winning, Paul Estrale couldn't get rid of him even if they wanted to. So, long story short, you want us to enter the tournament and beat him, right? Uh, yes. P please for forgive my asking. Jeez, why didn't he just say so? Are you sure this guy is really trying to take over the Colosseum? Of c c course, and he's being b b backed by L Leviathan's Claw. L Leviathan's Claw plans to use the c c Colosseum for income to, to, to dominate the other guilds. That sounds like a plan someone like Q Moore might come up with. No way! We already know Q Moore and Leviathan's Claw are working together. Hmm. Wonder what'll fall out of this tree if we shake it a little. Whatever happens, we have to stop Leviathan's Claw. Relations between the Empire and the Guilds will only worsen if we don't. What about Pharaoh? There's no telling when you'll be able to meet him if we get into this. Um, but... Estelle, what is it that you really want to do? What I really want to do. I, I beg your pardon. I, is this a d difficult decision for you all? There isn't anything difficult about it. What do you mean? We're going to do it, aren't we? We've listened to the story now at any rate. R right. As a guild, this might not be something we can just ignore. So then, who'll be entering the tournament? Well, we can't ask Estelle, Rita, or Raven to participate. After all. This is a job Brave Vesperia will be doing for Ruins Gate. Okay, so? No hard feelings, but I'd rather not have to go up against Judy. Hmm? And I was just getting ready to enter. Oh well, I suppose I can sit this one out. The boss here shouldn't have to trouble himself with this. So it's up to me then, right? Um, right. So, d do you mean you'll take the job? Sure. Beating the champion will be good for our guild's reputation. It's not a bad deal for us at all. Yeah, you're right. I see. W well, please proceed to the registration area when, when you are ready. The sword's gonna slide out of the sheath. Don't worry. It'll be fine. I need to make sure this is the good one I want. Uh, yeah, I'll be sword. 
Okay, I believe... Yeah. Now we're going to do... I think five battles in a row. See the show? Have the call a seat. You want to give it a go? I want to give it a go. I had a feeling you were going to be a contestant. All right. Oh, boy. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the brutal battles of the Nordopolica Coliseum. First off, let's go over the rules of the tournament. This is a single elimination tournament. No second chances here. If a fighter makes it through three thrilling rounds, he or she will then challenge the champion. Fighters, if you best our champion in the ring, not only will you receive a fantastic prize, but you'll also take the position of champion. What's up with his nose? I don't know. And now, on to the first fight. Yuri, good luck. You'll do great, Yuri! Try not to hurt yourself. <sighs> I wanted to fight. You're still going on about that? Look at all these people. Well, this should help advertise our guild nicely. In today's first fight, a new face in the Coliseum. Hailing from the new guild, Brave Vesperia, please welcome Yuri! His opponent, a former knight turned political activist with a prison record to boot, Gigantus Erengar! Gigantus Erengar? Hey, Gigantus. One a battle-hardened fighter, one a fledgling youth. The outcome looks set, but is it? Welcome to the crossroad between heaven and hell! Our first fight is on! Fight! Oh man, it's Erengar. You'll be gone soon enough. I have to scan all these motherfuckers. I'm not allowed to miss a single one. Okay, so I have to do all these fights the same way, pretty much. Just trick him completely. Come on, try it. Now, that didn't work. There we go. Alright, one combo. More than half your health. Oh, he's he's saluting. Uh, I guess that was an okay warm up. For our second round, we welcome the hellacious bandana clad thief, Yugum Jerome. Excuse me. <laughs> Where are the starfish? Give me the starfish. What? Versus Brave Vesperia's Yuri Lowell! Don't let your guard down, young warrior! The battle has only just begun! Knock your opponent down to the gates of Hades! Second round! Fight! What does that mean? You'll be gone soon enough. That's Yugum. He's got more health. All right, try it. Ow. Do it. Good old new voice acting on one attack. Something like that, buddy. Ow. All right, just go away. Go away. That was too easy. On to the third round! A masked warrior, undefeated with the sword, Johan Damark! Soon, you will know the exquisite pain of my sword! Versus Brave Vesperia's Yuri Lowell! Is it blind luck? Is it pure skill? Everything will be decided in this one battle! Which of these warriors will extinguish the flames of their opponent's burning soul? Fight! Alright. Be Final battle now. before the champion. There he is, barely stronger than the last one, although higher level. Ah, I couldn't time the... 
I love that combo. Ow. Ow. You hurt. That's a good combo. No thanks. Come on, you can do better than that. Hey, I got a Tsurugi for that. Thanks. Wow, look at Yuri go. Looks like he's got the goods all right. Well, it just keeps getting better. Now it's time for the main event. Allow me to introduce the current and undefeated champion of the Coliseum. What? What do you mean? It's the heartthrob with the steely gaze, Flynn Shifo! <laughs> Yuri? What are you doing here? Huh. So you're the evil villain who's trying to take over the Coliseum. Very funny. Want to tell me what you're talking about? Huh. So we're being used. It seems that way. Men of the Coliseum, let the flames of your valor burn bright! It's time for the final showdown! Oh boy. Aren't you cutting it a bit close? Hey, these people didn't pay good money to see a rigged fight. You hey, Viper. Ease up a little. Like you're having any trouble blocking me. Oh god. He fucking just guns it for me. Okay. He's tough. Oh, man. This fight is all about not losing. You can't win this, and you also can't lose this. Well, you can lose, but if you do, you fail. And you're also not allowed to win. Uh, so we just gotta not die. So, care to explain what you're doing here? You know, nightly duties and such. Afraid that's all I can say. Since when is becoming the champion of the Coliseum a duty? Especially for a captain of the knights. I'm not at liberty to say. Oh, please heal. Thank you. Oh, please don't take too much damage from that. It's not a chaos. Oh, good. That's a good time to heal. I'm popping a second one. All right, buddy. Come on. I think it's great you're taking your promotion so seriously, but be careful you don't bite off more than you can chew. You're the one taking this seriously. It's been a while since I've seen you enjoy anything this much. And don't you think it's about time you returned Her Highness? You'll have to take that up with the lady herself. Her Highness tends not to listen to the things I tell her. Yeah, well, Her Highness isn't particularly fond of taking my advice either. All right, let's actually fight now. <laughs> Ooh, ow, 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 ow. Well, shall we put an end to this little show? How? If we quit now, they'll boo us out of the building. Yuri Lowell! Oh, God, there he is. <laughs> oh, you gotta be kidding. What do we have here? Has someone arrived to steal the spotlight from the stars of the show? Yuri, you've managed to stay alive long enough for me to kill you. Now let me show you my thanks. <laughs> Hate to disappoint you, but I got other reasons for sticking around. You are the only man ever to make me bleed, and I swear that you will die by my hand. Man, why not do something a little more productive with all that energy? Watch this! Whoa! What is that? Oh, it's a Blastia! I can't believe he tried to use it like that! I've got a bad feeling about this. That Blastia... Judith! Hey, what are you doing? What could this mean for the tournament? Oh, screw this! I'm out of here! How do you like my arm? You did this to me, and now I'll use it to destroy you! <laughs> Yuri! Come, Yuri, let me show you my new toy. Now you're starting to get on my nerves. Oh boy. Please tell me I set my party up right. We did, okay. I need to get every secret achievement in this game. 
This guy's secret achievement should be really fucking easy. Step one, we're gonna set everyone to defend, so nobody fight. I need to switch to Rita. <laughs> and what is my easiest spam spell that will hit him? Probably Tractor Beam. I'm gonna put on up. I'm gonna put there. We're gonna spam Tractor Beam. Now you will meet there we go. Doom. Do you seriously think I'm gonna let you get Enjoy Tractor Beam. Like it should heal him, just so you know. But don't worry about it. It's fine that it heals him. Don't worry about it. Oh yeah, when you just scan him. Yeah, it, it doesn't matter that it heals him. That's fine. Just keep healing him. More healing. Heal it more. Oh, he's not healing anymore. More of it. Oh, I'm out of mana. Heal him more. Or hurt. Doesn't matter. Yeah, that's good. Heal him more. Heal him more. How's he doing? Right, he's not dying yet. Good. Let's do some regular fireballs. Yes, good. Eat more. Eat more spells, buddy. Consume them. Yes! I'll kill you. His arm basically fucking imploded. He, it's, it looks fine, but it, it's not working anymore. You have to overload his arm with a fuck ton of spells. And that's a secret achievement. And we've done it. So, time to kill him. Ow. I need to taunt him. There we go. Nice taunt. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, fuck. It hurts. Please heal. Oh, I wish Nurse was a faster casting spell. Oh, he's angry. Raven. I need to set your attacks up again. Because you got new attacks and I haven't set them up yet. Uh. Rain. Uh. I don't like bouquet. Are you still on defend? Yes. I'm gonna change it in a sec. Glimmer of Heaven. That should be on up. Uh, Arrivederci. Uh, no. Uh, Sign Instant. Up. Uh, or no. Uh, right. Just like dancing. Right. Uh, Arrivederci. Down. Wind Blade. Alright, everyone go to moderate. Tiger of Dead Sheet. Yeah, I missed. Alright, let's fight. I was too late. Don't blame yourself. I'm fucking missed. Alright, uh, we need to revive Yuri. He's fucking dead. <laughs> oh god, he's right next to him, too. Taunt him! Give me more overlimit. More overlimit. More overlimit. Thank you. I'm gonna die in overlimit. This is health. 30k. Oh yeah, I never fucking equipped my new attack. Uh, what was it? Tiger Blade? No, oh, what did I get? Shiny Eagle. That's the one. I fucking love Shiny Eagle. That hurts! Just oh! Jeez! Christ! Also... 
my healer isn't healing because she's out of mana. There we go. I'll protect you. This is a fucking hard fight. There we go. Where did I put uh, Tiger Blades? On off. Okay, so. Rita's fucking dead. Oh no. Run. Haunt him and run. Just go for me. I'm right here. Awesome. Holy sh- ow. Please no. Fucking hell. Jesus Christ, the aerials. Okay, help. Oh. Oh. Die. Jesus. Nice hand. Okay. You and that weird arm. <laughs> a poor excuse for a person. Oof. Got him. Uh, salad. No, beef bowl. Get our health back. Hey, we got dice. I'm not done yet. Hooray for the old man. Hooray for the old man. Oh, it's out of his control. That's what he gets for using it like that. This damn blast is not doing what I wanted to. Monsters! What are they doing here? They're kept here to be used in the tournaments. That shot just now must have destroyed the barrier blast here that was holding them in. He's getting away. Damn it. Guess we'll have to take care of the monsters first. <gasps> oh man. More fighting. Hold still. I'll make Any new quick. monsters? I think you're new. Yeah, Death Mantis. New one. Okay, weak to wind. Should be easy. Ow! Get out of here! Let's go. More beef bowl. Uh, there's more. Yeah, I oh, guess we'll fight. We're bull. I like it. I like it. I like it's tappy foot. Oh, oh. I need to try something. Manual. I need to try that manual cancel. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Okay. I prefer semi auto, but manual's nice. Healthy, I'm about 600, dying. Oh, ow. Holy shit, you hurt. Everyone's asking for fucking. Hey, that was a nice break from things. Thanks. Everyone's asking for items. I'm not giving you a million of the gels. I don't have that much money. This is becoming a real pain in the neck. Less talking, more fighting. You missed. What? Jesus. Hey, what's going on? Could this box be causing everything? Him. Hear me, knights. Sodia will command this division and eliminate the remaining monsters. Shouldn't evacuating these people come first? The rest of you will defend the spectators with me. Don't let even one of the beasts escape. Huh. 
Looks like Flynn was thinking ahead. He even sounds like a real captain already. We're getting out of here. Judith and your puppy dog already took off. Yeah, I heard. A hero's work is never done. Hello? Wait up! Hey! I love Raven. Oh no! My dog! And Judith. Why? He stole my dog! I need him back! Real quick before we chase after them, I have to go on a shopping spree. I have to buy... Uh, beef. And... Lettuce. It's important. And... Magic lenses. There we go. Thank you. Also, there we go. I was gonna save, but it didn't let me. He got out of the city. He's pretty good at running away. Repeat is still after him. Hopefully he won't lose the trail. But what's the deal anyway? Why would Regay Think he set us up somehow? Of course he did. Have you ever tried reading his name in reverse? It looks that way. He used us to keep Flynn from carrying out his orders. You should read his name in reverse. Orders? Relax. It doesn't look like he's here to recapture any princesses. He wouldn't go through the trouble of entering the tournament for that. Well, then what could it be? Good question. Whatever it was, I'm sure it was hurting Regé's plans. But Regé seemed so polite. He didn't seem too polite when he was making off with that case. This might mean Ruin's Gate is nothing more than a false front. Still, what could he want with that case? Just what was the clear Ciel crystal? About all we know now is that something you figured in that box it out. my magic go all haywire. <laughs> no. Jaeger runs the Assassin's Guild. I never lost control of my Bodhi Blastia like that before. Hey, if we've got the time to be standing around chatting, shouldn't we be chasing after your dog? And has friend? an aggressive aggressive German accent. You're right, we should be going. Hey, Judith's back. My dog's still gone. Gotta go find him. Damn that reggae. What could he possibly want with that case? Well, our genius mage's magic was kinda weird. He must have thought it was linked to that box. Then, you think Brigay knows what's in the box? The only way we'll find out is by going after him. If he stole it knowing what was inside, then he must know what the clear CL crystal can do. If we catch him, we might learn something about Jormgen. Okay, now we definitely can't let him get away. Yes, we don't have a moment to lose. Yeah. Bet it was an ACOG in there? It was. First, I'm trying to save! Move out of the way! NPCs sometimes. Just move. Please. You like that corner? Is it in, is it fun over there? Is that a fun corner? All right, thanks. Uh 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 if I stand in like a eh Nope. I saw the save icon for a second. Ah, this is a bug I've never ran into before. That's funny. Oh my god, that's funny. You asshole. Alright, well, fuck it. I'll save in the next spot. Just if we lose now, I'll have to redo everything we just did, so if I get into hard battle, I'm gonna put it to easy, because I ain't redoing that fucking entire Coliseum fight. That was like eight fights. Fuck that shit. Oh. Let's just make sure I'm not missing any side quests. Nope. Not until the Wii's end, anyways. Repeat. Look, is this? Repeat will be able to follow his scent with this. <clears throat> We've got to get that case back. Yeah, there's that too. Guilds don't take kindly to backstabbing cheats. That's right. He couldn't just cross the mountains to the west without preparing first. We should be able to catch up with him. All right, let's get him. 
Do you think the Colosseum will be okay? Nah, it's fucked. Are you worried about it? Do you want to wait here with Rita then? What do you mean? This is a guild matter after all. Nothing for you little ladies to worry yourselves over. Sorry, Estelle, but I'm going too. I'm curious about that red case. Besides, I won't feel right till I give that idiot a piece of my mind. Then I... Decide for yourself. I... I'll come too. If he was trying to obstruct the Knights, then this could be connected to the Empire. Hmm, maybe. Anyway, the Colosseum will be fine. Flynn's got a handle on things. Well then, let's get our things in order and go after that jerk. Let's go. Hey, repeat's back. Altosk, Fortune's Market, Ruins Gate, and the Blood Alliance. Huh, that makes us one short. Huh? What are you talking about? The Union's five master guilds. We've dealt with four of them, but not the last one. Oh, hey, I don't think I even knew the last one's name. Hey, Carol, what's the last guild called? Ah, that'd be the Blacksmithing Guild, the Soulsmiths. Huh, I didn't know they had a guild for that, too. You've probably used swords forged by the Soulsmiths without even knowing it. You've seen weapons embossed with an iron hammer, right? That's their guild emblem. Oh, yeah, the innkeeper where I used to stay had a kitchen knife with something like that on it. Great. I can probably save now, because that woman probably stopped hogging the save point. Like a rude bastard. Can I have my save point now? Yes. Thank you. Alright, I believe we're on to Weez and the Kados now. Yeah, we are. Weez and the Kados is a fun dungeon. This is where I'm gonna get a whole bunch of shit I've been waiting for half the game to get. But for Weez and the Kados, I don't want Raven in the party. I want... this. And Carol. I didn't respect her enough. Well, that's why she stole my save point. There we go. Uh, is that a new enemy? It is. Don't hurt us now. Oh, there's a lot of new enemies. Squirgle. Okay. Ow. Thanks. Hey, you got spider web. Nice. I'm out of, uh... TP, I can't do shit. How's my Shining Fang usage? Almost a hundred. Ow. Got him. I've been missing lightning wave. Yeah, a lot of help. Raven, stop failing to cook stuff. And he learned lucky limits. Still learning stuff though. Still on learning stuff? Yes. Good. And here I thought all we'd be doing at the Colosseum was beating bad guys. Now things have gone and gotten complicated. I certainly didn't think we'd be seeing Flynn here. Not to mention that Zoggy guy. And that runaway coward, Regay, too. It can't be a coincidence, not with them all here at once. If it is a coincidence, it's the worst one I've ever heard of. Just how bad can our luck be? You think Leviathan's Claw are the ones calling the shots this time? Thinking things through is all well and good, but we don't want Regay skipping out on us. No kidding. We'll finish talking later. Let's go. I agree. It was a fucking squirrel. It, it, it was a level 27 something squirrel. No levels. Anyone close to leveling? Oh my god, repeat. One fight. Alright, good. 
Anything hidden up here before I enter the Wiznikados? Uh, not that I can tell. Alright, let's go in the Wiznikados. By the way, here's the entire world map. It's kind of hard to see because it's transparent. And I haven't filled it all. <laughs> the big game. Easier to see when it's dark. And in the actual map menu. Oh yeah. Big game. So far I've fucking... I've only been here, and I've only been there. I'm missing a good chunk of the game. Long fucking game. Alright, well there's Luis Nicados. No sign of him so far. Do you think he went this way? Maybe he used this to get through to the other side of the mountain. But this cave is the Weezen of Kados! A powerful monster called Terapus lives here. It's supposed to be really dangerous. Or at least that's what Nan told me. Perhaps he went inside without knowing that. Hey, Weezen Kados. I don't see Hermit Drill. like he was hiding out here hoping we just pass him by well now let's have a nice long chat what were you trying to gain setting us up like that back at the Coliseum and get back that case you leave me no choice Leviathan's claw of course Still, are they new assassins or old ones? Uh, Titans. Oh, Etanes. Those are new. Those are new. 31. And they have more health. What about the Etanes? Meryl, good fucking shit, dude. Oh, that's a good move. Here I go. Here I go. And he's dead. These guys are all over the place. Valid. Damn it. I feel this power inside me. Guess this means Ruins Gate and Leviathan's Claw are connected. So they pretend to help with the excavations, then swipe materials and sell them later, huh? Who oh, I'll make them pay, I swear. How could a guild as famous and renowned as Ruins Gate do something like that? Judith, wait! He'll get away if we don't hurry. Remember what I said? There's a really nasty monster living in there! Hey, what do you say we call it a day? Old Raven can't afford to get too far from Nordopolica without getting this letter to Bellius. The Don will hit me with another one of his thankless jobs otherwise. Well, I'm going after him. I can't let somebody like that just do whatever with the Blastia he takes from the ruins. Then I'm gonna get that case back, too. Uh, I'm going, too. What are you talking about? You're staying put here. I'm not. Huh. This doesn't sound like something Brave Asperia can very well pass up. Yeah. It's our job to protect Estelle. If we all go together, we're bound to come up with something. Well, let's fucking go. Sure you'll be all right without the great raven? I think so. Good luck delivering the letter. Ugh. Jeez, aren't you even gonna try to stop me from leaving? No. In fact, you aren't leaving, you're joining me. Oh, there's Hermit Drill in the back. There he fucking is. Motherfucker. What level is Hermit Drill? 
I think it's like level 34. We might be able to beat him. What happened to his face? He probably froze on an animation. We do that sometimes. Thunderbat spiders. Thunderbat. Alright. And I wanna go for the spider. Go. Fire. Oh 30. Good XP then. Do it. Really? Your art's been sealed twice? Come on, dude. Well, you keep thinking like that, and I'm sure you will. Uh, yeah, spider web. I need that shit. I need it. Okay, uh, you please recover on him. Okay, well, I'm gonna need Carol in every damn fight in here, but Judith isn't doing that great. Uh, Storm Rita. She knows what she's doing. She'll kill stuff. Kill bottles. Thanks. Can I hit you or no elevation? All right. Let's eliminate them. Oh, it's a bear. Garrix, and we got a bear. Beast bear. I'm gonna go for the bear. I'll blow you away. Of course it knocks him down. Get up. There we are. I'm just gonna do regular attacks. Get my TP back. Here we go, got most of it back. Let's go. Are we getting bear skin? I do need that. Raven finished some of his skills. Which ones? Oh, entire bow. Do you have another one? Yeah, you do. Smash bow beta. And I alpha type cyphos. Uh, let's do the smash bow first, because it's the w worst weapon. Fighters! Punch them! Now's our chance! It doesn't seem fair. Who cares if it's fair? The sign of victory! Alright! Hey, that kinda hurt. Hey, you should get aerial jump. Finish your weapon then? Or you did, and she has no new weapon to use. Great. Mighty Guard. Ooh. Uh, that will give you a pretty big increase. And what about Raven? A smaller increase. Okay, so it's more important for her. Got him. We have a great opening now. All right. I'm gonna go with Carol. He got a new move, didn't he? He's got Punishing Smash. Still only has Hammer Flow Upper for Arcane? Jeez. Let's go! Carol's a good character. He's just really slow. You'll be gone soon enough. These bats are probably the worst. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. 
Blocking. Got 600 health. Just die. This? No, this isn't scary. Your legs. Your legs are shaking. Uh oh, there's Hermit Drill. Uh, I want to save a point before I attempt him. There should be one soon. Uh, that seems further into the dungeon. Get ready. I'm taking you down. Here I go! Hey! Uh, Spike bow. Nice. All right, let's see if we can find a save point and then go back and fight her Madrill. I want to fight her Madrill. Oh no, it's Patty. Did you just hear something? Right here. Whoa! Wait, Patty. Ah, we meet again. You sure pop up in the weirdest of places. Still looking for Ifrid's treasure? I. I am. Hey, what kind of treasure is it anyway? Prepare to have your socks blown off. It's the Maristella. What is that? Um, I... I'm not sure. Wow, even our walking encyclopedia hasn't heard of it. Out of Eifried's treasures, the Maristella is the most precious. Well, has anyone found it yet? They're called treasures precisely because they're hard to find. You're a weirdo. Hey, I heard in Nordopolica that you're Eifried's granddaughter. Is that true? Whoa, little lady, that right. I wonder how the Don would react if he found out his sworn ally had a granddaughter. Now that you mention it, the Don and Eifried were friends since before the Union was formed, weren't they? But hey, you're lying, right? About being Eifried's granddaughter. I mean... You never said anything about that before. It's the truth, I think. You think? What do you mean? I mean, I'm speculating. Estelle's asking why you would claim someone's your grandfather based on just speculation. Oh, well, that's because I have amnesia. Good for you. Am... amnesia? Yep. Then you don't know for sure whether you really are Eifried's granddaughter? There's no doubt it's true, I think. Ugh, come on! Make up your mind! Which is it? Because I don't know. I'm searching for the Maristella because I don't know. So basically, to get your memories back, you want to meet Eifried, a guy who might be your gramps. And to find him, you're looking for that Maristella treasure. That sound about right? Aye. Someday I'll meet my grandpa. But on a more urgent subject, shouldn't we be going after the Red Box? Oh, right. Oh, is she joining? Hey, why are you following us? I was planning on going this way anyway. Then why don't we travel together? I'd like that. This isn't like going shopping, right. you know. I know that. If something happens, I'll help out. Well, aren't you helpful? Hey, she's joining the party again. She's actually a very fucking good character in terms of battle. I'm putting her in the party. She's good. She's really good. Okay, this is gonna be a terrible audio quality, isn't it? I had thought that amnesia was only in stories. Yeah, it happens why is it... all the time. Get caught up in an explosion during a failed Blastia experiment, and there go all your memories. But losing all of your memories is pretty rare. It's a tragedy. That it is. It's also much more quiet. Yeah. Even if your past memories are gone. You can start creating new memories from now on. There's no need to be pessimistic. I see. That's a different point of view. I'll stuff my mind's album with memories of Yuri! Yuri and more Yuri! Just thinking of it makes me shiver. 
I... I hope there might be a little room for me in there. I... I think we can squeeze you into a corner somewhere. Great. Where's the save point? Oh, my God. Is there even a save point further in? Can I do a manual save? I cannot. I might have to just attempt hermit drill and see how it goes then. Have, oh, she does have a new weapon. Allows the delay after form change to be cancelled with a backstab. Occasionally steal gold and escaping from battle. Still the same gun. No new armor. Bastard. I hit him. Got him. You're going bye bye. She's a harem? Nah. Okay, she's in Brainiac form. Good. Just don't eat half our HP, please. Oh, she got critical. Nice. Oh, no one took that insta kill? Come on. Alright, let's try Hermit Drill. There he is. He's a big boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Hello, level 34 Hermit Drill. Weak to water. Rita, I unlocked your water attacks again, didn't I? Yeah, I did. New move? Oh, she's got resurrection! Fucking finally. I've been waiting. Oh, ow! Sleep. Sleep. Oh, sleep. I'm asleep. Ow, ow. Ah. Come on. Oh, fuck. Please, no. Please don't. That was 900 damage. Out of nowhere. Oh, nice. Alright, we're 30% uh, of the way there. He only does a third of our health bars in a single hit. And Rita's dying. Ow, uh, ow. Uh. Oh! Good night. Please no. Uh oh. Please heal me. Thank you. I need more. Are you causing nurse? Good. I'm just gonna range him from that right now. Oh, Hattie dead. Casting resurrection. Health. Oh, not much. Okay, I'm switching to Rita. What was it weak to again? Water. Where do I have my water spells? A down is champagne, down is splash. Okay. I am so gonna make you hurt. Fucking hell, I just killed the shit out of him. No, please. No, please.
Fucking hell, he's dead already. We're almost done though. 8k health. Nope. I'm so gonna make you hurt. Ready? I. Oh. Let's go. Fucking hermit drill, my dude. Rita's pretty OP. That's the logical outcome. She is the power mage of the group. She uh I'm not done yet. Oh, I feel so She murders. Hey, Carol got second attack, finally. Carol. They just need to get speed charge. Keep working on that. Uh you're done with the you're done with that dagger. That I'm not gonna pronounce. Uh Holy Raven 2A. Work on that. Uh, no new weapon for her. She's still learning that. She's done with the yo-yo. She's got the upgraded one, though. Or the perfect green. Uh, 530 magic attack. Uh, 527. Okay, let's use this one first. Still learning Basilard. I'm done with my sword. Do I have more weapons than one? Or just, just the Damascus? Just the Damascus. Okay. Let's get Raven into the party for some fights. And repeat. For fun. Wow, the days just fly by. What's with you all of a sudden? Oh, I've just been thinking about how strong we've grown without even realizing it. That's because we have terrible luck. What does getting stronger have to do with having bad luck? We keep running into one mess after another. The Empire, the guilds, everybody hates us. So all this bad luck made us fight, and so we got stronger. Is that really luck? It's all right, Carol. As we travel, the winds of luck are little by little turning in our favor. Exactly. Luck just flies by too, like the wind. Yuri, you're kind of missing the point. <laughs> all right, let's make sure I'm not missing any side quests here. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. Good. Should be some loot down here. Yeah, I guess we'll fight. Well, let's play Raven. I like Raven. Also, I need to figure out. Down. Hit. Oh, that's how I do it. Hold this button and I can just pick a character and be like, use this move. Okay. I usually just go in here and then do it. This is a shortcut for it. That's good. Uh, is it just a bear? Oh, it is. Do his feet. Raven, stop failing to cook. Hey, Verbena. Do need that. We have a great opening now. Fuck it. Playing as a dog. Let's go. Oh, demon dog. I love that move. Did you get a new uh Light spear. That's right. I got a light spear, and I never put it. Oh no, I did put it on. It's right there. Ow! Ow! Valid. I'm not done yet. in the chest. 8,000 gold. Take it. We got 44,000 now. Which we will immediately run out of in seconds because I spend it fast as shit. How's our levels? 30, 31, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30. Good. I don't remember when we get our really fun moves, but I think it's soon. 
I think there's stuff we go down here. Oh, yeah, a patty weapon. And a weapon for uh, Judith and an aquamarine. Judith, here's a new weapon for you. Aerial combo. Lucky soul. And cross counter. Oh, that's good. That's not a bad weapon. And we got a weapon for Patty. Fighting lens. Automatically use a magic lens when Patty defeats an enemy. That's good. Critical guard and resist. Okay, well, once she's done learning this weapon, we have an upgrade for her. Awesome. Don't get sloppy. How's this? Oh! I've heard of that move. Yeah, I've heard of this move. It's not bad. But it's not going to replace Tiger Blade. So, sorry. Also, I've used Azure Edge 732 times. Ow! Oh, really? You're just gonna walk by me? Oh, you got around. Double slash me a knife. I need to try to remember, once we get to about level 45 or 50, I need to remember how to unlock Gold Cat. Because that's one of the best moves for Rita. In a one-on-one. -on -one. Gold Cat is stupid. Oh, man. I need to get All it. Right. Let's go. Gold Cat. Oh, he's dead. Oh, I should have played that scene. That's a good one. I've seen it before, but a good one. And your scroll. Hey. Hold still. I'll make this quick. Let's go insane. I'm just getting started. Nice. A lot of Mandrake Eyes and Dizier Gold Dust, which I need. We got Step Cancel F. Good. That's half of our weapon, right? Yeah. Sticky Finger is going to take forever to fucking get. Ah! Help! What is that? Air? This is just like at Cape Mock. Is there an air crane here too? What do we do? Charge right in. I don't think so. Judith is right. Touching air that thick is dangerous. I I can't believe that something like that would s save me. Wait. Ah! It looks like we'll have to keep our distance. W what's this sh shaking? Hey, it's Pharaoh. Is that the monster you were talking about, Carol? No! I've never seen a monster like that before! No, Patty, don't! Whoa! It ate the air? No! I... I can't move! Oh, no. Ugh. This is not good. Well, hey, I can move. You're not getting away again. 
He's getting away. <laughs> Rita, be careful! Don't worry, it's not harmful at its current density. What the hell just happened? The monster we just saw somehow normalized the air crane that was out of control. But that would mean that it can control the air. Could it be the same thing that guy did with his sword back in Cave Mock? Can we pass through it? Rita! Oh, uh, right. It should be okay. All right, charge! Uh, Patty, please be careful. What's the matter? I have to figure this out. I mean, this is what I'm traveling for. Come on, Rita. I know, I know. We have to follow him, but I just... That air cranny isn't exactly going anywhere, is it? Of course not, you idiot. Oh, I see what you mean. Okay, let's go. All right. Carol, are you okay? Y yeah. Peachy. No, really, I'm fine. All right, let's go then. Catch up to that bastard. That monster's power. Was that the Rizomata formula too? Monster that consumes air? Just what was that creature? It did seem different from other monsters somehow. Yeah, that's for sure. It also looked like it was staring at us. Maybe it was wondering which of us to eat first. It, it looked into my eyes for quite a long time, actually. How nice for you. He must have thought you looked the tastiest. I don't think I'd call that nice. Ha. Huh. There's no bats. Here we go. Finally a save point. In 30 minutes. All right. Hitboxes! There we go. Come on. Aw. Oh. Let's work together. I want the free stun. Ow. That's over. Beef bowl. Raven's getting better at cooking. Good. Uriah, new weapon. What's that got on it? Steel Plus. Yes. That'll be very useful for when we start really doing side quests quite heavily. There's one that requires us to steal two weapons from an enemy, and it's a bitch. You'll be gone soon enough. Got him. First aid. Oh, brilliant angels, grant us your faith. Repeat. Your tail? Let's go. Egg bear claw, nice. And an egg. I never would have guessed there would be an air crane in the Weezen of Kados. Me neither. I guess nobody passing through ever noticed it. It must not have been putting out enough air until now for anyone to feel the effects. Sounds right. It sure picked the perfect time to start going crazy. That was a serious pain. Well, I was able to log a new discovery, so it worked out in the end. Yeah, so glad you enjoyed yourself. So, someone has one of those air crane you found? Rita, you explain. I'm all ears. I've been participating in the conversation, right? Ah. Uh. Yeah, I guess we'll fight. I guess we'll fight. Plays Raven. You must do better than that. Hoo ah! Take this! Take this! All my heart! All my heart! Alright, who's next? Get out of here! Ah, uh, a round is such a hard attack to use. Or sign instant is such a hard attack to use because it never hits anything. Ever. Go around on there. Have a spin. Come on, wind. Knock him around and cut him down. Wind blade. Holy power, come to me. First aid. Repeat. Uh, 
Uh, let's switch the party again. I like switching it up pretty often in this place. Uh, uh, yeah, Judith. Judith, get in here. And Carol, get in here. Still are so lit. Still has the iron one. Yeah, much better. I think we missed the bronze one even. Uh, up there or this way? This way. Now's our chance. It's nothing personal. Let's do this. All right, we got new Moonblade, which I like. Moonlight Havoc. Ascendant. There we go. Oh yeah, I forgot. Downwards attacks with her. Oh, he's got Reaper Knock. I hope you can. You keep thinking like Reaper Knock is the dumbest looking attack because he literally just shoots a baseball with his weapon, but it hurts so fucking much. <laughs> it's such a powerful move. It did 2k damage. Fine, Ripper. Oh, shit. See, that's got good stuff on it. Yeah, FS bonus. Defend two. And Estelle can use it as well. So can Flynn when we get him back. Whenever that happens. Ooh, they look scary. All oh, Lunar Eyes. Good move. Good move. Get up. Never mind, just die. That works too. More salads. Now we're the final part of this dungeon. Before the boss. More These salads. The hey. Auto medicine too. Uh, she got anything else to learn? Spine Ripper. And that's it. Alright, she can start learning the Spine Ripper then. That's alright with me. And there's the healing save point just before the boss. Alright, before we go into the boss, I need to remind myself what the secret achievement is for the boss. Uh, 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 destroy the leader. Okay. All right. All right, let's set up my party then. I want Rita. I usually like her for boss battles. Uh, you're, of course, Estelle. Who will be good for AoE? Addy? Sure. Let's let's give Patty a try. There he is. But but how did you? Good work, Rapide. Looks like our little game of tag is over, Reggae. <laughs> 
Now, I'll have to show you my really real power. Hey, there he is. No way! Huh. So that's what's been going on. What does this mean? Was he disguising himself as Regay? I don't think we have time to worry about the particulars right now. Oh, me, oh, my. How terribly frightening. I don't know what I'd do if I were to end up like poor Rago. What do you mean? What happened to him? Oh, they found his body face down in a riverbed back in Dongrest. I just couldn't bear it if I ended up like that, you know. Rago is... dead? But why? Mm, afraid that's not for me to say. I, my lips are zipped up tight, for sure. <sighs> The rest I leave up to you. As you wish. Aye, aye, sir. <laughs> He's getting away. Not on my watch. I'll see you in the funny papers, Liebchen. Oh boy! Terpus! Yay! Little Big Chef, delicious. Ah, oh, there we go, okay. Now we split, there's the leader. That's the one we gotta defeat. Uh, leader, and then there are magic bats. Come on, come on, gotta scan them all. Then there are attack bats. Alright, where's the leader at? There he is. Leader bat. No weaknesses or resistances. Well, I'm gonna drop fucking tractor beams on him. I am so gonna make you hurt. Ready? Tractor beam. Ready? Tractor beam. I'm not finished. Ready? Tractor beam. Oh, you fuckers! You fuckers! Stop casting at me! All right, how's the leader doing? There he is. Oh, uh, so fucking high up. How's he doing? 10k. Uniting again. Got to scan him again? Nope. All right. Okay, uh, don't kill him too fast now. Defend. Defend. Okay. We have to wait for him to split again. Do a little bit of damage. There we go, split again. Leader. Alright. Everyone, folks, the leader. I can't hit the leader. Get him, get him, get him, get him. No! Who keeps casting not me? Protect your casters. Real taunted. Factor so beam. Yes! 
All right, leader's dead. Now it gets easy. Ready? Talk to me. Uh, I'm gonna play Patty. She's fucking dead. I'm gonna need to be resurrected in a sec. Two left. Kill the magic one. It's a bitch. No. All right, who's next? God, this fight is a bitch. But we got the secret achievement. First attempt. Oh man! Come on, let's go. And getting a first attempt. Good by me. from our enemies you're not gonna make fools of us but with those injuries let us withdraw bye bye for now man this stinks where'd this smoke come from oh, oh, oh. they're throwing our canine friend here off the scent as long as we put up with the smell we'll be fine but i can't stand that smell we're going after them. No, we're not. Loot in here. Second piece of loot somewhere. Yeah, there it is. Over hat. I'm going back and saving. And getting that free full heal. All right, now that that's done, let's see. Are there any side quests we're missing? Ah, we have to go. We have to do a little bit of backtracking. I will do it with a holy bottle on, so we don't get ten million fights. If I have any left, yeah, I have ten. I'll do it with a holy bottle so that we don't run into too many fights. Because we got to do quite a bit of backtracking. Eh, it's not that much. Oh, I have to fight you, because he's in the way. He's blocking. Still. I'll make this quick. We're all full health anyways. Oh, she's got the card throw on. That one's not bad. You can keep that one on. <laughs> Good job cooking more salads. Where is he?
Oh! I'm a fool. We have to do something really uh, funky. We gotta leave the cave and walk straight back in. We can't stay in the cave. Because then it doesn't load the event. We have to actually leave the cave and just walk straight back in for it. That's why it didn't spawn. Leave the cave. Uh, wh what is with this heat? It's a desert. We've passed through the caverns and come out on the other side of the mountains. So you mean... Those are the sands of Kagor. Whoa. You made it all the way there? The sands of Kagor. Pharaoh's here. I... I'm going on. To meet Pharaoh. Wait! We can't just let you go alone. I mean, our job right now is to protect you. Well, we did get the stolen box back, right? Yeah, I guess we can't just keep chasing him around. <laughs> Alright, we'll take care of him next time. Hold on! Are you seriously going? Do you know what you're saying? This is a desert. It's hot. People die here, get it? I'm ready for it. I think. The desert is divided into three regions. Huh? The foothills to the west, the center where it's hottest, and the massive peaks to the east. Uh, hey, hold on! There's a town between the end of the western foothills and the central area. Where did you hear that? I went there with a friend once. It's a nice town built up around an oasis. We'll hold off on any major decisions until we get there then. Sounds good to me. Old Raven wouldn't be able to think straight till he cools off. What are you gonna do, Patty? What's that treasure you're searching for? Maristella, was it? Well, I can't guarantee you'll find any clues in that town, though. Don't worry. As long as there are people, I'm sure there'll be clues. Well, there are people living there. Then I'll be joining you. Rita. I know. We'll make that our first destination. Yay! I'm still trying to get my head around the fact that Regay was Jaeger's alter ego. This spells out the connection between Ruins Gate and Leviathan's Claw pretty clearly. And that Jaeger was the boss of both guilds. Isn't it kind of early to say that for sure? It is possible that the Regay we met was just Jaeger putting on a show. Maybe the real Regay's off in some ruins someplace, just digging away, happy as a clam. We're gonna have a hell of a time if it's really that complicated. I don't know. Maybe I'm just puzzling over it a little too hard. We'll have to keep at it until we get to the bottom of this mess. All right, let's leave the cave. Ah, and let's go back in the cave. Because this is a stupid missable side quest that isn't really important, but I'm doing all of them. I'm 100%ing the side quests, at least the ones that matter to me. I might not do the fucking 100% monster book and 100% collection book, because you need literally every monster and every item in the game. I, I don't think I want to do all that. I don't think I have the patience. I'm using another holy bottle. I have nine of them. I'll have to fight one enemy anyways. That bear that blocks the freaking path. This one. Unless he wants to be nice and just let me through. Nope. Let's work together. Well, it should be easy. That's what happens when You know where to go? Of course. I've played this game before. I also have a side quest guide, because side quests require a guide. It's him! If you're here for the air crene, the monster already got it under control. I heard. Heard? From who? But Regay uh, I I mean Jaeger was the only other person here then. Wait, then you and Jaeger are I thought I told you. Stay away from the air, Krenne. Sorry about that. We just totally stumbled on this one by accident. Honest. Then you will leave immediately. Do not return again. Hold on a second. Uh, 
Okay, what is with his attitude? We're already here, so we can just leave after you've examined it. You're kidding, right? Aren't there plenty of other things we should be doing instead? Well, we do, but... <sighs> we all do. Estelle. All right, then. Let's go. Rita, you too. All right. Yeah, uh, I've played through this game before, although this version of the game uh, it has the PS3 content, which was never on the Xbox version. Uh, so there's some new stuff. And I also have a side quest guide, because even though I've played through this game four times, you need it. The side quests are bullshit. They are complete bullshit. They're worth That's doing. What when I get serious. This power hey, did she max her weapon or just a few skills? Uh, just a few skills. Is, is anyone? Oh, you maxed your weapon. I should have switched you out a long time ago. Anyone else maxed their weapon? Nope. Let me through. All right, let's go to the next town. Where? Look at my side quest guide. I believe we got some stuff to do. Yeah, we do. We have one of the most important side quests in the game that you should little you should do even if you're not doing any side quests. It's it's stupidly important for the main quest. It's huge and sad. All right. I should also fight some of the enemies if there are any new ones. I believe there are. Oh yeah, there's the cactus spider things. I should fight them. Can I get a double fight? Yeah. We'll destroy them in no time. Patty, uh, scan them for me. Green spider. Wait a few seconds and cactus. All right. This is it. Ow. Ow. We're done. There we go. Hey, a lot of level ups. I think Carol just finished his weapon. He did. Do I have any other weapons for him? I do. I got the Zognol. Is that Zognol weapon? Magic guard, magic. Okay, a lot of defense on it. Higher damage than what he has. I also want to. Or battle voices once again. I think that's all the enemies in this area. I'll. Yeah, it is. Okay, good. All right, let me pause for a sec. Okay, good. Seems like a pretty sleepy town. Well, in this heat? There are knights even here, though! I don't recall seeing such intimidating people here the last time I came. All right, I'm off to search for clues about the treasure. Bye-bye for now. You're leaving? Oh, so you want me to stay a little longer, eh? Well, it's been fun and all, but I'm sure Patty's got things she needs to take care of. Uh, then I guess it's time for me to be off. Be careful out there. All right, shall we each go our own way for now? <sighs> On for that. Before I do anything, I want to give these feet a rest. 
Okay then, let's meet up in front of the inn after sunset. Okay, see you then. No easy thing looking out for everybody else. Well, I think we all could use a little time to think things over. <laughs> the kids are all right. Party with everyone. And men take. This is a good city. There should be some really good stuff in the store, and I can already see the Wonder Chef. He's not really hiding very well. I wouldn't think the knights would bother coming all the way out to a border town like this. More power to them if they're really here to defend the public order, or whatever, but... Something tells me there's more to it than that. Yeah. Let... Oh, God. Oh, I found the one reporter. Oh, you found me! While you sleep, I've been sneaking in and updating your wonder log. Oh no, you know my precious secret, and yet you're the first person I've ever told. It's alright, just let this stay our little secret, and I'll keep sneaking up to your bedside and working my magic. Oh no, I think I just violated the reporter's code of confidentiality. Bye. I'm scared. Guess you found me, you're pretty good. I'll teach you to cook as a reward. I learned to make curry. Gotta go, till we meet again. What an amazing man. All right. Time to talk to all my party members. Yuri. Hey, why the long face? Is the desert really as dangerous as they say? I don't think Rita'd joke around with such a serious look on her face. Yeah, I guess not. I've dragged all of you all the way out here. You should stop worrying about all of us. Huh? I mean, we're just doing what we feel like doing. But what about you? What do you want to do? M me I... You were saying that you need to figure out who you are, weren't you? Yes. That's true, but... Estelle, you're Brave Vesperia's client. If you tell us to go somewhere, we'll go there. And if you tell us to go for you, we'll find Pharaoh and drag him back here. Yuri... Then I... There's no need to rush to give me an answer. Take your time. <sighs> Alright, there we go. Let's find where everyone else went. Anybody go this way? Oh, Patty's here. Huh? You're still here? What? Were you feeling lonely and came to find me? Isn't the reason that you've been wandering around here because you're the one who's lonely and wanted to see me? You got me. Now marry me. I'll consider it when you're an adult. Ah, there you are. Who are you? Uh, just an acquaintance of hers. He's my husband. Well, whatever. I got the info about the Maristella that you wanted. I appreciate that. But first, is it true that you're Eifried's granddaughter? Huh? It's a rumor I heard. Is it true? Hmm. So it is true. If that's the case, then I can't give this to you. If it gets out that I did business with the granddaughter of a guy who broke the guild's rules, no one will trust me. Eifried is... I don't know about you. But for those of us who live in the world of the guilds, Eifried is the most unforgivable guy out there. I can't afford to be involved with someone going around claiming to be one of his relatives. So don't you show your face in front of any of us ever again. <sighs> and if you pull anything on any of the members of my guild out of resentment, we're not gonna take it lying down. I can guarantee you you'll regret it if you think that World Cellar is no more than a map-making guild. But I'd never do anything like that. Oh, really? In any case, the blood of a coward who would attack ships while feigning to protect them runs through your veins. I can't even begin to guess what's running through your head. Mm. And as for you, I don't know if you're really her husband, but I'd suggest steering clear of this one. I'm not. So you just take it all in silence, huh? 
I just don't know whether he's actually my grandfather and what actually happened in that massacre. I don't know what's true and what's a lie, whether he was a villain or a saint. All I know is that my grandfather was very important to me. That is why I can neither admit or deny what people say. So you don't even know who you are yourself, huh? I know that much at least. Then wasn't there something you could have said? It's okay. I'm used to people saying all sorts of things about my grandfather. I don't care about any of that nonsense. I'll just keep searching for treasure in my own way. You're putting on a pretty tough act. You better not start crying once you're all on your own. What good would crying get me? You see, my motto is, no matter how tough the situation is, crying gets you nowhere. Well, I guess it's really none of my business. Still, it's not like you can go treasure hunting without any clues. Oh, don't worry. I've got clues. Later. Oh, there she goes.